Hey, 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 little bike work today. This thing is stuck in low gear. A lot of pedal revolutions going downhill. So we're going to fix this right quick. Take off the handlebar. Grip. If you can't get it off this way, you can stick a little something underneath there and put some uh, rubbing alcohol. Help get it off. This one came right off. Yeah, we're not going to change the cable. We're going to disconnect it from the rear derailleur. I'm putting this pliers on here to make sure it doesn't slip too far. And we're going to mark it also to make it a little bit easier to put this back together, get it right where it was. This nut's on here really good, and of course I grabbed the wrong tool. But uh, a nut driver or a socket's going to work better to loosen this up. Disengaged. Eleven thirty seconds. Okay, now we've created some slack. Let's pull it back toward the grip. The grip shifts basically a two-piece assembly and just pulls apart. Yeah, downshift's just fine. But uh, try to go the other way. You're staying there. has a metal spring in this one. I guess sometimes they're plastic. And when you hear that clicking sound, it's what you're hearing. So I call it the click spring. Yeah, this thing's really dirty, grody, and gritty inside. I use a 2.5 millimeter Allen wrench to uh, loosen the set screw that holds this inner half of the grip shift mechanism. And you can just pull the whole thing off the handlebar. And we'll clean it up. And there's still this old blue grease in there, and I'm going to use a Q-tip and get as much of that out as I can. This is a high quality uh, multi-purpose grease that I've used for years on all different kinds of mechanisms with success.
So I'm trying to get all the contact surfaces of the uh, inner and outer half there, where they where they meet, where they mate, and any other parts that that move in conjunction to one another. Cardinals uh, are providing the uh, background audio. Thanks, guys. I believe this uh, clicking spring played a major role in the jamming that was going on. So I'm hitting this up good. Oops, backwards. It'll only go in there one way. Just kind of, kind of turn these two pieces and twist them until you get them into a position where they'll uh, snap together. Doesn't matter what gear for now. Hey, hey, hey! We're back in the uh, multi-shifting business. Let's set the derailleur back up for first gear. I don't remember why I took this nut off all the way, but you certainly don't need to. We're just going to get this uh, kind of loosely tightened up for now until we can uh, get it into proper position. Once you have it where you want it, but it's not tight yet, that set screw, you can put another vice grip in there to hold it there. It's easier than your fingers. So there's our aligned derailleur in first gear. And the grip shifter in first gear. Alright, now let's just put plenty of torque on this. Well, as much torque as, as we can get with a nut driver anyway. Okay, just verifying that nothing slipped. Perfectly aligned in first gear. Okay, let's take this for a road test. Camera in left hand. Quiet residential street. And we're right in seventh gear. Thanks for watching. Have a great biking summer. And please subscribe.